Coming up on Home and Away, tragedy strikes in Summer Bay when Stevie succumbs to her injuries. Summer Bay is in chaos in the aftermath of Stevie's shooting, as the film star lies critically wounded in Cash's arms. He tries to keep Stevie talking, but she's unconscious by the time the paramedics arrive at the beach. As Stevie is rushed to hospital, Remy storms the operating room and begs Bree to promise she'll be okay. She complies, but Levi fears that Remy should be preparing for the worst. Bree is desperately performing chest compressions on Stevie, determined not to break her promise to Remy. It's no use though as Levi gently tells her it's time to stop, Stevie's gone. Bree calls the time of death before breaking the devastating news to Remy that Stevie didn't make it. Remy is inconsolable over losing Stevie and angrily rejects Bree's offer of support. Looking for someone to blame for the tragedy, he confronts Cash and accuses him of failing to do his job of protecting Stevie. His words cut deep and Cash admits to Eden he feels Stevie's killing is all his fault. Remy soon softens towards Bree and they share an honest conversation about their relationship. Refusing to agree with her belief that their romance was defined by trauma, Remy tells Bree her survival instinct made him love her even more. Bree gets swept up in the moment and leans in for a kiss before backing away, feeling ashamed that she made a move on Remy while he's deep in grief. The exes agree it's best they give one another some distance, but privately Bree questions if she's still in love with Remy. From the safety of her locked home, a frantic Felicity calls Dane and warns him to stay away from the club as there's a shooter on the loose. Just as Dane is processing the news, he turns round to see Stevie's stalker Sydney standing nearby. A chase ensues, but Sydney is able to get in another hit, which leaves Dane lying motionless on the beach. Felicity rushes to her ex's aid and is relieved to find he's unscathed. Cash is next in the firing line when he arrives home to find an armed Sydney waiting for him. The dangerous gunman refuses to believe Stevie's actually dead and scrolls his phone for confirmation of a fatality. Moments later, Eden returns home and Cash tackles Sydney to the ground while she rings the police to come and take him. Rose breaks the news of Stevie's death to Nelson and the crew but asks they don't publicize anything until the film star's family have been notified. She then dashes over to Cash's place and places Sydney under arrest. The evil killer cackles in delight to learn that Stevie is dead before being dragged away in cuffs.